Welcome back, everybody, to Farming Simulator 17. Here on No Creek Farm 17, your host with not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, you're taking a picture of our my service truck slash my personal truck, kind of for the farm. But I got some good news and some bad news. This is going to be a overlay, uh, a voice overlay. Uh, I'm just pretty much telling y'all about the truck there a little bit and talking about some other stuff. I can't remember what I recorded uh, yesterday and I can't even remember. But I know we got uh, this field here to finish with beans. I think I'm going to turn my hood on there it looks like. But yeah, it's going to be a voice overlay. I am very sorry but for some reason my microphone quit working. The, the very first time that I quit, you know, I don't check it. Because usually when I start, I'll go test, 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 you know, make sure it's working, see the bar move. I, I just got on and started recording. It paid no attention to uh, I think this is, what, 38 minutes long or 30 minutes, somewhere in there. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't. I was frustrated, folks. I shouldn't have recorded this video, but I really, I'm getting, I'm trying to, slim out my videos because I'll fix to do some changes on my maps and stuff. Uh, I did discuss some of that on here but as you can see <laughs> my mic wasn't recording. Uh, it's plugged in and everything. There's something about OBS. And, uh... But anyway I got a new it's called Stream Labs OBS that I'll fix and try to start using. Now, folks you look there on the map and stuff and you see I made a boo-boo on field, I think 11 there. I started planting corn with that one planter, and I just made that big boo boo. So, but I was planting with the little bitty one, which you should see here in a little bit. Um, yeah, this one right here. I get back to it. But anyway, that little planter, I was planting the edges and stuff. It ran out, so I grabbed the corn planter since I was done planting corn. Thought I switched it over to beans, but apparently I did. So, but uh, yeah. So we're just finishing up that field there, and that's the last of the beans. Uh, think I'm fixing to do a course play here and get this and go back to the shop since we don't need it no more. But yeah, folks, we're going to be doing, oh well, I'm going to be doing some updates and uh, I was going to wait till more towards June the 1st to do them, but since I'm having so much trouble here lately, uh, you know, my microphone wasn't working on this and I've been having problems with uh, Corn Belt, the, the series, uh, it's getting hard for it low and that should be later on this evening at 2.30. I uh, should have it come out explain a little bit more. I think it worked good. I'm going to go back and check it after I do this. But yeah, it, it's been a nightmare, folks. Uh, yeah, you can see there i got 16 and 11 installed straight shot with beans. Except for the little bit of corn we planted. But it looked like that one planter planted over some of the corn. So that was a blessing. But I love No Creek Farms. Um, I know some of the fields are challenging. Uh, our equipment's small right now, but uh, I think I'm going to be dealing away with at least Corn Belt. And Shenanigans might run a little bit longer. It is kind of small and stuff. But I want to stick with Oregon Springs, No Creek, and Autumn Oaks. And I do have a couple other maps, but one or two of them is kind of huge. So we might just do, if I can get OBS, this new one, to work right where my computer can record and stream at the same time. Uh, well, stream and play at the same time, I should say. Um, right here, I was trying to fertilize the field, but I got to remember it's got to do the first stage of growth before I can fertilize it so I'll just take it up here and park it for now uh, but anyway uh, 
Yeah, the Streamlabs OBS beta. Uh, it's totally free. I was watching Nick and he had it on his channel, so I downloaded it, but I haven't started it yet. So, uh, I might wait a couple more days on it. I'm not for sure. I'm kind of curiosity killed the cat, you know what I mean? But I'm just hoping, like, heck, this is, uh, recording now, because I don't have no way of telling on my editing software. I'm recording on my editing software right now, so it might be a little bit lower voice. Checking the couch right there. Really don't know why it took so long. I am having problems on my controller, too. Uh, my D-pad on it is, yeah, it was the left arrow, you know, pushing over to the left, but it seems like the right's giving me problems now, so, um, <laughs> my Xbox controllers, you know, my son and daughter plays the Xbox One, and I do the PC a lot, and they go through a lot, folks, it's, it's like a, I don't know, it's, it's to a farmer's sense of point, it's like putting a, a small tractor on a giant chisel plow and trying to pull it all day long. That's the way our Xbox controllers are. They really get overworked. Um, even if they're not playing Xbox, they do their YouTube and stuff on Xbox and they're steady pushing buttons and stuff on that to control YouTube, fast forward and stuff like that. But, uh, yeah, here on this, I'm just trying to run the seeds out of this one real quick. But I end up, I don't know if I show or not, but I think I end up running out of seeds on both of the planters. Uh, this one and the, the big tractor. And I end up having to take out a $5,000 loan to get a $1,000 seed crate. And only use about 40% of it. I take out about 400 liters of seeds to finish planting the far end down there. But uh, y'all see that here in a minute. I probably won't talk all the way through this. I'm probably going to maybe fast forward it by two or three. I don't want to go too fast because y'all won't be able to see it. Just be heavy washed. Well, I want to call it going across the screen. I want y'all to be able to see it for the ones that do want to watch, and for the ones that's listening. I'm sorry about my voice and stuff, but uh, I know it's probably going to be low. Y'all have to turn the volume. Yeah, I'm thinking about, you know, another five minutes or so of talking and then put some video, I mean, some uh, audio tones with it. Uh, I wish I could do a little bit more here. I know y'all can't see the stuff that's on my screen, but I would like to uh, do some of this, but I'm afraid it's, yeah, it won't let me scroll down. But that one song at the beginning is called Firefly. It's on YouTube. And uh, down below in the comments, leave, leave a, a comment to let me know what you think about the country songs I've been playing uh, I am getting it's saying the copyright claim has been made but it says that I'm not in trouble that it won't hurt me nothing so I hope that's true I know a couple of other YouTubers use legit copyright songs on theirs and they ain't got in trouble yet so I think as long as I don't claim money against them I'll be fine uh but yeah, they just sent me an email and saying, hey, you know, copyright claims have been made. Uh, all proceeds going to the one that claims to have it. Uh, nothing will happen to my account. And uh, nothing to be done further unless, you know, I have disagreement against it. So I, I, I don't care if they get their money. You know, it's going to be a long time before I make money on this. I'm not really doing it for the money. Uh, I like to record and just talk to y'all. Uh, it helps get things off my chest and stuff. Doing this. Uh, I wish I could do the live streams better. That way, you know, y'all at least text back, let me know how y'all feel and stuff instantly instead of having to wait 
until I get a chance to read the comments. <sighs> but anyway, um, speaking of comments, uh, there might be a time or two during the week that I might get a little behind on watching those videos and answering the comments. So please don't hold that against me. I just uh, got fire meeting on the first and third Mondays of each month. Uh, they're getting where they're longer, so 6 p.m. Monday to about 8 or 9, we're doing training and stuff like that, going over to trucks and stuff, and that just gets tiresome after that. I don't feel like doing nothing else. I go home, take a shower, and go straight to bed. Uh, there's going to be bigger changes because school's going to be out here pretty soon and you know they're being home and stuff so it's going to be a little bit harder to record I'm going to kick them out of the room for a couple hours so I can record also I was wanting to do a up not an update but a shout out to a fellow that wanted a shout out. I don't usually do it that way. I usually wait till you know they're sub to me for about a month and do a shout out. Which I need I got a whole list of those. Y'all are awesome and I'm sorry I haven't done it yet. I just uh, really ain't no excuse. I've just been flat out lazy and tired. But uh y'all gonna hear me say but um a lot I guess. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm thinking I'm just moving that up by the way. But I'm fixing to send the others down. But uh, I, I love the new shed that I installed with GE. It was uh, a little tricky to do, but I figured out, you know, I can take it, measure it, and then I can stick it under the ground until I got my land stuff leveled. And then I just pulled it back up. But uh, I done it. See, there goes another one. I need to count them. Wish somebody would give me a penny every time I said it, that. Anyways, uh, I just leveled my ground out and I went back in the game, played a little bit, drove around, made sure the ground was smooth, saved it, and uh, upload, you know, pulled the shed back up out of the ground. All right, here I'm going to the other side to plant around this side here, and I think that's where I realized I'm almost out of seeds. And it should be getting time for me to um, yeah, it won't let me zoom out on the timeline. But anyway, it should be getting time for me to do a cut here in a second because I've done two parts to this. I ran out of seeds and I was telling y'all that I'm gonna come back when I was almost done with that field and uh, I think I went ahead and finished the field and then got everything cooked up for the mowers because we gotta start sellage, uh, wrapping sellage bales, making some money. That's about the only way you make money on this map is mow the grass, bale it wrap it and then haul it to the market as sellers bales. But it is a good way you know. Well as far as back to the updates and stuff to the channel, it's just gonna be I think we're going to how can I say we're going end corn belt here pretty soon after this I'm planting all the fields and beans and I think some of canola and we're going to sell that off and we're going to take that money which probably about two million dollars and we're going to move that money over to a new map come up with a new timeline you know, just, I think this in here I, I told everybody you know my uncle passed away and he left me the farm and I got to build my farm up because it didn't have very much. That's usually what everybody uses, and I, 
I just want to change it up somehow though. Probably uh, my uncle got rich, didn't want to farm no more, moved off with a bunch of heh, heh, young women and uh, there I am washing the tractor off. Yeah, I just went through the, the skip there where it's hard to piece it together, but it looked okay, so I guess I'm going to leave it like it is and just keep on talking. But yeah, I've got the Ford right there hooked up to the trailers and they're ready to go. I'm taking this tractor over hook up to the baler or the rake or something. And then I realized I didn't really need it, but I did. If that makes any sense. I need to put the tractor here. I have to turn it around and put that rake right there on this tractor. Then put the baler behind it. So I got all the beans planted and uh, I didn't record it or nothing but like I said it took an extra 400 liters so I had to buy another bulk bag of seeds there which cost I think what thousand dollars so I had to take out five thousand dollar loan just get a thousand dollars worth of seed and only use 400 liters out of the thousand liter bag so uh, folding the mower up here so I can get out the door and then uh, the hay bale storage thing is all right but the concrete right there with that mower won't let me hardly steer so I had to do some fancy removes on it there but uh yeah folks I, I really don't know too much to talk about right now is uh, as far as I know, only one that we're going to lose will be Corn Belt. And actually, Autumn Oaks is going to slide in there with Corn Belt. Um, Corn Belt and Autumn Oaks is probably going to still be the 1130 videos. And Oregon Springs and Sonellitans will probably be the evening videos we're going to try to spoof them up where we can get along a little bit faster have more episodes of them and that way um, you know, we'll kind of get all the fields bought or get a quite a big farm established we'll probably end up ending it because we'll be doing stuff over and over and again so just trying to keep things alive you know to not let y'all get bored uh, on the FS17 maps I got Bates Cass County Missouri USA map coming I got it downloaded and I can't think of the other one there's some weird name it's a big map uh, you can actually hire a uh, guy to fly a plane and fertilize the field so y'all might that might give some of y'all farming folks a uh, idea of what map I'm talking about I can't think of what it's called Casadilla or something like that I can't really pronounce it and I got another one I'm trying to think of what it's called I don't know folks, I am so bad on these maps and stuff. Uh, I did download a Terragator spreader uh, for dry fertilizer. It's the three wheel spreader. Uh, so I'm going to try to use it. And we also got a new J JCB front loader. And we, uh, now this is not in real life because I ain't made it in real life yet. But we I have found a case IH stick stinger stagger or whatever it's called track. It, it's like the cat challenger, but it it's a, a case on tracks. So yeah. And I also found a new seed wagon too. That's pretty interesting. I'm gonna keep it a surprise. 
so uh, that's some of the mods I'm going to be looking forward to. I did download a John Deere massive mod pack where it's got all the planters, sprayers, and stuff like that in there. And right here, folks, as you can see, I'm just, uh, I'm telling y'all about the baler right there where you, uh, left B and up on the D-pad will reset the baler counter. So that's one good thing on it. And there I'm telling you about how we don't need hay bales or grass bales because both of them's full. We just need some solids bales to fill that up and then turn around and get a uh, some straw bales out of the wheat when it gets ready to harvest. But yeah, the solids bales is the only way we can make money on this map is pretty much selling grass for silage. Uh, it, I wish I could. I need to test out. There's a bunk to to the right here behind that shed right there. There's a bunker back there we can put grass in, and I'm supposed to be able to tarp it to make silage. And that way we can use a, a front loader, get a front loader, and ship it out by a semi. I, I need to try that to see if it works. How about get a couple thousand liters in there and just try it? Um, I don't know what I was doing there. I think that was one of the guys, and it's supposed, supposed to been a guy, but it was a girl driving the tractor. So, I'm like, yikes. And there's our Ford. I was telling about the strobe on top. And, uh, I think I turned the emergency flashers on and checked them out ears in front there and uh, I get that to I turn the truck around get it in line we'll fix it. head out to the field and, and uh, get everything going see if we can get everything going but uh, when we do get out the field I'm probably going to fast forward this a little bit and try to get it down because we've probably got another 10 15 minutes to go uh, I'm getting tired of talking folks. I know I can do it 30 minutes long, but for some reason I'm tired today. My doctor's appointment was supposed to be in this morning for uh, my regular doctor, my family doctor. Uh, come to find out I didn't need to go this morning because I could have sore up and down. I had no refills on my bottle. But I checked them this morning to see which one I need to take with me. And all of them had refills on them. So I'm like, okay, doggy, what was I looking at? And then uh, Thursday, I got a doctor's appointment for my pain management. Uh, my family doctor got where, I don't know what happened, but he can't prescribe pain pills no more. Cause I guess all this stuff that's going on with NASA's. But uh, anyway, so that's why I have to go to a different doctor. I especially need them for my back, my lower legs. Or my, my lower back and my legs. And there, folks, I was checking the prices of uh, beans and corn. Like both of them's in a couple of days. The first day of mid midsummer. So, uh, yeah. We need to uh, make sure we remember to do that. Which I won't be fast forwarding time anytime soon. I'm going to be working straight out. Even when I go to the next episode, if we're going to be leaving off on the same day. Because I don't want to fast forward time until it gets like night time. It gets so dark you can't already see. That's when I'll fast forward to the next day. Because we got a lot of grass to mow. That's a lot of money right there. If we fast forward, we'd just be wasting it. Cause if we can go ahead and cut that grass, then fast forward time, that's going to help us. It will make the grass, you know, the grass grow faster because time is accelerating. But uh, I, I think I'm going to get off here and insert a couple of songs, folks. Um, like I said, I hope it's recording good because I got my air on. It's 
11 o'clock, a little after 11 o'clock, and it's already 75 degrees in my room, folks. And the only thing I got going is I had the ceiling fan running, and I got my computer running, uh, tablet, and my phone is running on games, making me money. Those games you play that makes you money. You get so many points for, you know, so long. Uh, I got damn set on auto, uh, which I'll explain more of that later, probably. But I got that going, and I got my AC going right now. The, this is the computer recording, editing, and the AC running. And uh, it's 75 degrees. And I was going to try to seal the fan on, but it makes a sound when it's going or at least that's what it recorded last time so that's why I'm not using the cell fan while I'm recording but like I said I, I've done some tests on this editing while I'm uh, talking so I hope this voice overlay is okay with y'all on this one. and I'll try not to do it again so please don't roast me too bad but yeah I'm fixing to get off of here and I hope y'all enjoy the rest of this. I'm going to try to put some songs in here I think y'all might like. And folks, I love each and every one of y'all. And I hope and pray that y'all having a great day and a blessed day. And folks, y'all take care out there in this heat. And don't forget to check on your, your elders, your loved ones. Make sure they got some kind of air or at least a box for you, folks. But anyway... Like I said, y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see y'all tomorrow. Don't forget to hit that like button, share me with your friends. If you're new, subscribe, folks. See you later.